two and chain B start from a point P on a circle at the same time. Let's look at this. A and B from a point P. A moving in clockwise. So A moves clockwise. B moving anti-clockwise. They meet for the first time at 10 a.m. when A has covered 60% of the track. So this will be diametrically opposite. This will be somewhere around 60% of the track. This is the first meeting. They meet at 10 a.m. If A returns to P at 10, 12 a.m., then B returns to P at what time? A returns to P at 10, 12 a.m. So let's think about A alone. To travel this distance, A has taken 12 minutes. This is 40%. 40% of the distance, A travels in 12 minutes. Remaining 60%, A should have taken 18 minutes to travel. 60 by 40 into 12 and just ratios so a would have taken 18 minutes to travel the first 60 60 percent okay, wonderful so this time taken is 18 minutes or total distance that a takes total time a takes is 30 minutes and both of them when have they started they started 18 minutes before 10 o'clock so the start time here is 18 minutes before 10 o'clock or 9.42 is when both of them started. They meet at 10 o'clock here and then A comes back at 10.12. A takes 30 minutes. Now let's think about B. Right? When A travels 60%, B has traveled 40%. Right? So A travels 60%, B has traveled 40%. Or their speeds are in the ratio 3 is to 2. Because they'll travel that much distance. The distance are in the ratio 3 is to 2. They've traveled the same amount of time. Speeds are in the ratio 3 is to 2. Or time taken will be in the ratio 2 is to 3. B will take more time than A. And so A takes 30 minutes. How much will B take? The ratio is 2 is to 3. Or B should take 45 minutes. 2 is to 3 is 30 is to 45. B should take 45 minutes to travel this distance. If B starts at 9.42. 9.42 plus 45 minutes. 18 minutes takes us to 10. And then a further 27 minutes takes us to 10.27. B takes 15 more minutes than A. A reaches at 10.12. B will reach at 10.27. Very interesting question. Just ratios. Nothing more than that. And so in, in a lot of these races, circular races, context where two parts are compared, ratios will take you home completely. Just think in terms of ratios. Nothing else is required.